Hello, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I am Brian Olivar, Atlanta's Real Tall Realtor, and this is Put Your Money Where Your Mouth Is. We're actually doing a special series today because we are doing a little bit of fundraising. Um, I'm going to give you where you can send money, and I ask that you do donate. But what this show is about, we're going to talk about it. We always meet with local businesses. I want to start off by introducing the famous Chef Keith Hand of Bridge Catering. So welcome to the show. Thank you, Brian. Okay, Keith, go ahead and tell us a little bit. So Keith is involved. Um, I've been using him for some of the Real Tall Real Estate events um, that we've had. The food's phenomenal. People rave about it. The last one we did was uh, those Nashville hot chicken, and yep. like that brunch that we did. Amazing spread. Anyway, so tell us a little bit about your business. Been in business for about 17 years. Um, we're right here in the heart of Atlanta, right near Georgia State. Um, we're a boutique caterer. Um, we don't do your largest events, and we don't usually do onesie twosies. We're right there in the middle for the corporate events, for household events, private events, and uh, we do a few movies also. And I've actually, I mean, I've been to some of, I've, I've worked with him on some of my events but i've also done events that he's catered as well the food is fantastic um one of our biggest things that started our relationship was my love of the pedophore and he makes a fantastic one uh something great over the holidays that i really appreciate anyway so what we're doing and the reason for keith's involvement today and us for bumping this up is um i'm sure a lot of you who follow me know that i work closely with brown middle school here in atlanta um it's about 70 percent impoverished most of the children that go there and it is a middle school so a lot of times the charitable needs aren't met because most people try to donate to babies and toddlers and things of that nature so um what was it probably about four days ago i um, was looking and some of you saw my post for total package um holiday turkey dinners and so brown middle one of the representatives that works with cis atlanta um, they're not allowed to fundraise or anything like that they, I was talking to her and asked how we could help, and she said we would like to provide Thanksgiving dinner for those less fortunate. And so some of these kids, um, they're either displaced due to their you know, family members not being involved, uh, living with their grandmother, what have you. And we adopted a lot of families last year, and some of our clients got involved and some of our vendors did as well. But I was researching online, and a lot of people recommended Whole Foods and Publix and Kroger. Um, the cheapest one I found was the $50 meal over at Publix. So I reached out to Keith. I know he's extremely busy during this time of year, and it's probably his busiest time for it's the most wonderful. part. Yeah. <laughs> and so he actually amazingly came in as the lowest bid just to help out. He's used his resources and really kind of dug in. I reached out to some of my vendors that I use year round, and they were really, they stepped up to the plate and helped us out with the pricing and with the quantity to be able to come in and, and make that price and make it work for these families. And so we're doing it for $32, $32. a meal. $32 a meal, guys. My Venmo is at brian Olivar. You can send that to me, $32 packages. If you can't give $32, we understand that we'll take anything if you can go ahead and send us we're trying to do 30 meals that's how many they've asked for and on top of it not only has he resourced his vendors but keith is also his delivery team will be dropping these off so that these kids will be surprised with these amazing turkey dinners what are you having in the actual package oh i think we agreed on we're going to do the cooked turkey we want the meal to be completely cooked and seasoned and ready to go so just in case everything in the house is not ready to go right. there'll be there'll be a, a complete meal and no matter what happens they'll be ready for thanksgiving we're doing the turkey yep um we're doing the green beans yep. we're doing the dressing we're doing the uh, giblet gravy we're doing the sweet potato uh, souffle we're doing the mashed potatoes yep what else we're doing rolls and, and rolls in the cranberry and the cranberry sauce and so he sent this over i was like wow and so it's it, He's getting this together, so out of his resources, $32, but I would like to use my resources. We want 30 meals. So anybody that's watching right now, go ahead and Venmo me. Um, we will get this going. We're gonna start delivering the Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday of um, Thanksgiving week. And so we're gonna space it out. If we can do 30 meals, we're gonna be 10, 10, 10. And what I will tell you is when we, did, when we adopted these families last year, on their wish list for Christmas gifts, if this doesn't make you feel so fortunate, and I love giving all year round, but at this time of year, it really makes you 
kind of cherish the things that you have. These kids were asking for socks and underwear. And it was kind of crazy to see on a wish list when our children or when you were a kid are putting on there like, oh, I'd like a Nintendo or something like that. These kids are asking for just the, the bare minimum that, that, that is needed. And I went through Hurricane Katrina. I know what it's like not to have anything. So that's just a huge part of my big why on why I love to get these organizations and in, in get involved with them. So I want you to go ahead, please comment below, uh, share this. Um, thank you so much. Come out and see Keith Hand. He's off of Edgewood. A lot of our clients that are in the southeast of Atlanta, um, it's a hop, skip, and a jump. You do like a lunch here too. Yeah, we do lunch. Hector's Kitchen will be open for lunch all during the holidays. Okay, so you need to come try this out. His food's amazing, guys. And um, it's just a, a, a quick spot. A lot of the hospitals. Uh, yep, the hospitals, um, Georgia State kids. Awesome. Well, um, make sure you're donating. Please, please, please. Let's go ahead and get these 30 meals together. Again, my Venmo at Brian dash Olivard. And I'm going to go ahead and post it in the comments as well. Thank you, Keith. Anything to uh, say on the Thanks way out? Thanks so much. Let's, let's help these kids out and uh, belly up to the turkey and dress them because we're, we're going to need more than 30. I think you're, you're probably going to need more, a few more. I so think so too. Let's help them out. Uh, give. That's a small price to pay for a giant step while it's cold outside. Let's let's take care of this real quick and wrap it up. Yeah, let's make it happen, guys. Thank y'all so much, and we will see y'all next time. Appreciate it.